Oh, the first of the week's maidens is next then. This is a one mile six furlong maiden. <clears throat> Quite a small field, but one or two newcomers in this. And not so many new horses this season as we weren't allowed transfers this year. And at the top we've got best mates for Graham Clutterbuck, Squadron, Sandridge, Marty Lillard, Cab Rack, a newcomer for Stu Gray, Alexandra Palace for Paul Rose, Krakatara, Rule for Drappy. That's a new trainer and a new horse. Dee on Star for Alex Cherry, Digamis go lightly for M. McMilk is another new newcomer. Freedom Kyle for another one for Drappy. And Gwitain approach for M. McMilk, another newcomer. So good mix in this then, away they go. And they've got a mile and six to go. And best mates and squadron Sandridge, the two with experience, are out early. And Krakatara, Rule and Freedom Carnival are going well as well but now Gwitain Approach has taken the lead so Gwitain Approach has taken it up in the second place comes Krakatara Raw for Drappy who's the new trainer unfortunately he's got exactly the same colours as Padraig Hogan and Satyam so that's going to be really interesting later on in the season if we get six of them in the same race so Gwitain Approach is the leader from Krakatara Raw second Squadron Sandwich is third Freedom Carnival fourth and a bit of a gap back to Cab Rank and Best Mates. Then comes Alexandra Palace, Dideon Star, and finally Digamist go lightly at the back. And Gwitain Approach has opened up by a good three lengths to Krakatara Rule in second. Squadron Sandwiches has been niggled along in third. Then comes Freedom Carnival back in fourth with Best Mates in fifth. Alexandra Palace on the inside after that one. Then Deleon Star alongside Cab Rank and Digamist Go Lightly is just the back marker. So I think it's M. McMilk who's top and tail in the field and leads by about four lengths to Krakatara Rule in second and Squadron Sandwich. Then comes the second of the Drappy Runners, Freedom Carnival. After that one, Best Mates, or Graham Clutterbuck, with Alexandra Palace, or Paul Rhodes on the inside of Alex Cherry's Dealey on Star. Then Stu Gray's newcomer, Cab Rank, is next, and finally Digamist go lightly the second of the M. McMilk horses, but it's Gitane Approach from that same stable that continues to lead by two as they come up past the five squadron sandwich. He's taking a bit closer order in second. The Drappy pair are now together. Freedom Carnival and Krakatara rule. Alexandra Palace, best mates trying to get going on the outside. Dede and Star now being wound up as well. Cab Rank and Digamis go lightly just finding the pace a little bit hot on their debuts. But it's Gwitain Approach who continues to lead. Squadron Sandwich though getting a little bit closer now. Probably only three parts of a length down. Best mates looks a big danger on the outside. Alexandra Palace creeping into it. Dele on Star. Jockey asks that one a quicker than it does so. They're Freedom Carnival and Krakatara rule after that one. Cab, Rankin, Digamis go lightly with work to do. Squadron Sandridge hits the front, passing the two ball. But Best Mates immediately comes to challenge on the outside. Gwitain Approach now looks to be beaten. Dede on Star running on in the third. But it's Squadron Sandwich then in the lead coming down towards the final furlong. Squadron Sandwich by a length. Then comes Best Mates and Dede on Star trying to get going. Is Alexandra Palace but passing the half furlong ball now. Then Best Mates hits the front. Best Mates take it up. Squadron Sandwich now looks one pace. And his Best Mates pulling away. Away, and Best Mates is going to take it. Best Mates takes it from Squadron Sandwich, who just about held on to second. Alexandra Palace and Cab Rank finished really well to get into the money as well. Best Mates takes it, so the experienced horses there, one and two. Best Mates for Graham Clutterbuck, the winner. Squadron Sandwich for Martin Little was second. Deli on Star for Alex Cherry, third. Alexandra Palace for Paul Rhodes, fourth. Cab Rank for Stu Gray was the best of the newcomers in fifth. <laughs>